visitor? What an unexpected surprise! Please, come in. Come in. I, for one, welcome a reprieve from our travels. That is, if you'll have us, kind sir. That's the spirit. Now come in. Make yourselves comfortable. I'm afraid we don't get many visitors out here. The Raptodons and Marauders scare off all but the boldest. And if you've braved them, you must be exhausted. Why don't you stay for dinner? I'm sure I would remember something like that. Now, quit fretting yourself about that. Make yourself at home. Dinner's almost ready. Oh, hello there. You come for... for, uh, dinner? Sorry, I'm not real good with, uh, names. Now, there's no call for being rude, Captain. Maybe he's just having a hard day. You don't know. You got a funny way of putting things. I used to be good with words. But it feels like there's this fog. I... Sorry, have we talked about this before? That's nice of you. I usually feel better after I eat. Mama said dinner's almost ready, huh? What a pleasant surprise. And just when I was beginning to fear we'd seen the last of good company for a spell. Yet the Eternal provides, does it not? Only if you give yourself over to the plan, Martha. May I call you Martha? By all means, just make yourself comfortable. Company is always a reason for cheer. The Eternal does not desire that we huddle and hide, crowded in by walls. We all share the spark of the Divine, and we were made to spread it across the stars. Out here, we are free. And even apart from society, the universe provides for us, as your being here proves. Just that your presence here is a gift to us, and one that we don't take for granted. Look at me, prattling on as if this gravy is going to cook itself. Why don't you run along until we are ready for dinner? I hope this fancy soap we got is extra strength. I'm feeling a... Oh, hi there. Did you come to bring us more of those rocket candies? That's wonderful. There was this other man who used to bring them. Not anymore, though. I don't know. I'm not... Mama and Papa said he came from the city. When we got sick one time, he brought those candies to make us well. And they worked. Now we feel better than ever. He said they were making us sick. Mom and Papa got real mad at him for that. They went to have a talk with him. Afterwards, they said he wasn't coming back again. Okay, maybe I'll see you at dinner. Perhaps we should skip dinner. My stomach has been a tad unsettled of late.
But what's this? You're tracking blood into the kitchen. Oh dear. You've been nosy, haven't you? Quickly, my dear. He's getting agitated. We can't let the meat spoil. Don't worry. We'll make this quick. Yes, these people deserved much, much worse. <laughs>